You know, as golfers, we're always striving to cut our handicap and improve our game. But have you ever thought about applying the same mindset to other aspects of your life? So guys, hey, I'm Nico, and today I want to talk to you about having a low handicap, not just on the course, but also in your everyday life. Think about it. What have you done recently to get yourself to a lower handicap? Maybe you've been practicing your swing more. Or dedicating extra time to your studies, such as reading self, uh, self-help self books. These are all great steps towards improvement. But what about outside the usual routine? Have you been actively listening to others? So listening may seem like a simple task, but it's something that we all, you know, overlook. How many times have you caught yourself thinking, I already know this, and then turned out the rest of the conversation, and like tuned it out, you know? Trust me, I've been guilty of this myself, and this is one of the things that I've been actively learning to try to listen and really tune in to what others have to say. We can learn so much more from others. We may think we know it all, but there's always room for improvement. So next time you're out on the course or in any aspect of your life, remember to give your listening skills a little tune-up. You never know what valuable information or insight you might gain. So remember, aiming for a low handicap isn't just about golf. It's about striving to be the best version in ourselves of everyday life. I hope you got something out of this. And uh, please like, share, comment, and tell me what you've been working on. Next time I'll see you on the green.